Good morning, children. How are you? Today, I would like to talk about something a little bit gross. Yeah, sorry about that. So, how many of you have ever had a day maybe when you just didn't feel the best and you had a really stuffy nose? Or you sounded like this, maybe. And your head was just, oh, and you just didn't feel very well. How many of you have had a day like that? Yeah, I know, me too. What did your parents have you do? How did they help? I've got one guess. I bet they looked for something like one of these. So a Kleenex or a tissue, yeah, maybe. And I bet they gently tried to help you and they said, hey, do this, put it up here and <gasps> blow your nose, right? How many of you have had your parents do that? Yeah. So why? What was going on there that your parents asked you to do that? Well, when you blow and you can get your nose clear, you breathe in and out and slowly that oh feeling in your head goes away. Today's lesson is another one about Jesus. Uh, and it's kind of a little bit about that. So Jesus is going to the temple, kind of like our church. And when he gets there, he finds out that there's a lot of stuff going on at the temple that doesn't have anything to do with worship, doesn't really have anything to do with God. He's finding out there's people there that are selling things, you know, like animals and all kinds of stuff. Can you imagine if you and your parents went to our church, walked down in, got into our sanctuary, and when you got there, you found Miss Mary Lyde selling birds, like lots of birds, squawk, 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 brr, in church? Can you imagine if up in the area the loft where the choir normally sits if pastor patricia was up there selling goats man can you imagine what that would be like oh my gosh that's basically what jesus found going on at the temple so one of the few times i think in the bible that i know where jesus really seemed to me he was pretty assertive and said hey let's get this done he moved all those people out he said hey we need to clear this temple um be because it was important. And similar to how you feel better when you blow your nose and get that junk out of your body, stuff that doesn't belong out of it so that you can breathe. With Jesus, it was about our relationship with God and saying, hey, this other stuff going on in the temple, like in our church, this stuff doesn't belong here at all. So let's get rid of it. And afterwards, um, people, their relationship with God was better yeah, at that temple, just like we usually feel better after we blow our nose. Will you pray with me? Lord Jesus, thank you for helping us get rid of what doesn't matter and gets between us and God. Amen. I hope you guys have a great week. Listen to your parents and be good. We'll see you next time. I love you. Bye-bye.